Good morning. I'm Ari. Today I want to share with you something that I've learned from my 40 years of teaching. This is a technique which you can use to teach effectively. So what is this technique? The first thing that you do when you meet your new class of students is to make your kids fall in love with you. That's right. Make your kids fall in love with you. Now how do you do that? It's very simple. First, you must have a lot of love in your heart yourself. You must love your kids. That's right. If you love them, you will show it in your voice. You will show it in your eyes. You will show it in the way you talk to them. You will show it in the way you refer to them. In Thailand, it's very easy. Because in Thailand, the teachers refer to the students as look. Look means child. So all our students are our children. So we love our students the same way like we love our own children. Easy. Now, why make your students fall in love with you? It's a very useful thing to do. First, think about what you do in a class. Do you go in there to impart knowledge, to fill the heads of your students with information? No, that's not what you actually do. What you should be doing is, when you enter a class, you should create an environment. To create an environment in which the students will feel that they are happy to learn, will feel that they want to learn. That's right, motivate them to learn. And what motivation can there be that's greater than love? So if your students love you, they will listen to you, they will pay attention to what you say. If your students love you, they will do Whatever homework you give to them, if your students love you, you don't have to buy them presents. You don't have to give them money. You don't have to punish them. You don't have to scold them. You don't have to beat them. All you need to do is smile. And they were feeling so happy. They would want to do even more and more and learn from you. Right. See? That's a very simple technique. So the first thing you do when you enter a class is to make a kiss fall in love with you. Alright, fall later.